When you're talking about Crescent Avenue in Midtown Atlanta, you're talking about one of the city's most exciting scenes. And right smack in the middle of it is a modern seafood house with fabulous food, some of the most creative cocktails, and a patio dining scene that you don't want to miss. Let's hang at Lure. Lure, uh, we think of as a, a modern fish house, where we try and use the very freshest fish that we can get uh, in Atlanta and feature it both in traditional and in, in novel ways. So there's a, a good mix of, you know, classics. We've got, um, you know, New England clam chowder, oysters on the half shell, uh, Louisiana style gumbo or Cajun gumbo. Um, but at the same time, we also do things where it's something that might be less traditional to, to American palates. Maybe it's something that's traditional in another cuisine, or it's something that's just inspired by the season. So what do we love about Lure? It's signature southern seafood, but it's across the board. It's it's not South Carolina, it's not Georgia, it's not Louisiana, it's all of it. Whatever you're looking for, right. you can get here. And we get beautiful, sweet, completely natural sea scallops from Boston twice a week. We cold smoke these scallops very lightly with applewood and then sear them. And they're served with a poached egg, white grits, crisp fried uh, spring medallion onions, nice and sweet. And then the other is a, a sauce, a, a butter sauce that has a little bit of uh, crystal hot sauce and a little bit of maple syrup in it. Something kind of sweet and spicy to pair with the smokiness of the scallops. Well, I think what's great about this place is they really take a lot of interest in keeping the food local. You know, they specialize in a lot of Georgia food. They call a lot of people up and they're like, hey, where's the best oysters in town? Where's the best shrimp in town? I think we're definitely known for our oysters. Uh, we always have a selection of uh, fresh cold water oysters. Catfish, you didn't even wait for me to give me a bite. Well, there, what's going on? I kind of attacked it. Yeah. It was pretty delicious, so there wasn't much left. This is the remnants. Yep. What did you have over there? I uh, had smoked trout club sandwich. How'd, how'd that work out for you? Uh, you can see there's nothing left of it. At the restaurant, we feature a lot of different um, smoked fish. Right now, we're serving smoked salmon with a little cucumber salad. We're serving some smoked sweet diver scallops with an avocado puree, a little bit of jalapeno, and fresh radish, and then a smoked North Georgia rainbow trout pate. We get beautiful whole trouts from uh, Bramley Trout Farm and up in such as Georgia, North Georgia. Um, they're really wonderful fish, and we get them about four or five hours out of the water. We try and keep it pretty simple and let the flavors of the fish shine through. We just have a little bit of tarragon, thyme, and lemon. We have a fairly unique uh, grill. It's called a Josper. It's a Spanish design. It functions almost like a hybrid between a grill, uh, where you get a lot of direct uh, heat from the charcoal, but also much like an oven in that it's, um, it traps that heat. Not all of the heat just escapes straight to the, to the air. It pulls a lot of that heat in, and so we get a really nice fast cook. That's the trout. It's very simple, and we just serve it with a little bit of drawn butter on the side and lemon. Can I try a French fry? Absolutely. Do you want horse radish beer? Yeah, I mean, come on. It's really good. We're all friends here, aren't we? We're all friends here. <laughs> it is really good. It is really good. The horse radish mayo is good. Mm. Don't That's need ketchup. Awesome. Don't need ketchup. You don't need ketchup. Mm -hmm. You don't say that often. The food is amazing every single time, and the staff is always approachable and educated. So it's always fun to come. The bartenders are great. It's good yep. to hang out and talk. And it's just a good place to come with friends. When we come back, I get a taste of Lure's take on the appetizer everybody loves, calamari. Atlanta Eats is back. We're back here with David Bradley, my buddy. What's happening, man? Hey. The veteran of the fifth group. You're like a guy that, like, you literally worked your way up right to the big leagues. That's right. How I've, many years have you been with these guys? A little over 13 years. What are we trying to do with Lure more than anything else? More than anything else, we're just trying to present really fresh seafood um, and let the quality of the fish that we buy and, and present speak for itself. What are we doing here, though? Because I'm feeling like squid. Yeah, exactly. I'm feeling uh, a little squiddy. This is our calamari plate. You know, it's a classic. A lot of people are familiar with fried calamari. Yeah, sure. Um, we, uh, we do a really nice, simple preparation. We don't try and change it up too much. Um, but the, the important thing to me is the quality of the squid we buy. Yep. It's a uh, really great squid from Point Judith, Rhode Island. And then we've also got some pickled shallots. Uh, both of those will get uh, dipped in buttermilk and then in a, a cornmeal mixture. It's uh, rice flour, wheat right. flour, um, cornmeal, and cornflakes actually ground okay. up. All right, so we just got squid and, uh, and pickled shallots here. All right. We go straight into the fryer. Squid is getting fried. How many seconds in there? I don't know, less than a minute, 45 less seconds. Less than a minute, it's yeah. ready to go. Yeah. So what's the best thing you can hear from a diner when they're walking out of here, when they're walking out of the door? Um, you know, just that it was a memorable experience and that that, that was the best fish I've had. Right. We've been hearing a lot, like, that's the best fish I've had since, you know, when I was growing up in Boston in, in the 60s, right. or that's the best fish I ever had, I've heard a couple it's times. A total great. Yeah, Atlanta can do fresh fish as good as anybody on the coast, relatively speaking. Yeah, I mean, these days, you know, trans the way that, that 
the, the market works, I mean, things can get transported here just as easily as they can to, to New York City or right. Chicago or anywhere else. We right. get really good quality fish here. Yeah, great looking restaurant too. It is. You ever get out there? Not too often, but you I try. You get those cocktails, those craft cocktails? The drinks are great, yeah. yeah. You gotta relax, I mean, there's a lot of pressure, <laughs> all right? I'm here a lot, yeah. So that fries up that quick. Yeah, really quickly, nice and, uh, nice and crisp and, uh, and not chewy at all. Just finish with a little bit of parsley and uh, lemon zest. We're ready, we're ready to rock and roll here? Absolutely, yeah. You want me to do this? You Please. already did. No, feel free. I mean, I didn't help much, really. No, that's all right. But yeah, I'm designated eater. Perfect. So here we go. This is the fried squid at Lure. Yep. One of the great seafood places. On the money. Hmm. Right there. Feel free. All right, I will. Thank you much. The big man, DB, <laughs> in the house at Lure. Thank you.